Hi guys, welcome to this Saturday morning upload which is a monthly shopping haul. This month I've done things a little bit different from what I normally do. What I normally do is get a monthly Tesco shop every month delivered but I've got a little bit bored and feeling a little bit uninspired for food and that. So a couple of weeks ago we went to Aldi and I got a little top up shop which is like you know milk, bread, veg, fruit, things like that. It wasn't more than £20. And I decided, because this was a different Aldi from the one that we went to previously a few months ago, it was quite big this one that we went to, so I decided that I was going to try and do my monthly shop there, and whatever I couldn't get there, I was going to go to Tesco and get the rest. So, what I'd done was <laughs> I planned all my shop, I planned it all, I planned all my meals and wrote down everything that I needed, and as I went round Aldi, I just checked everything off. The list and what I was left with, I went on the Tesco and asked the website and done a comparison to see what was actually the cheaper way to do it. And actually, there were some things that I couldn't get at Tesco or Aldi, so I needed to go to Asda for them. So basically, this month's shop is Aldi, Tesco, and Asda. So that's what you're going to see. The first part will be all the Aldi shopping, the second part will be the Tesco shopping. And the third part will be the Asda shopping. I did get the bulk of it at Aldi. I spent hundred, just under £150 there. And then it was just about £90 in Tesco and £20 in Asda for the bits that I couldn't get at Tesco that I could get there. So let's get on with the shop. For frozen items, we have a massive two kilo bag of British chicken portions, two bags of the chicken breast fillets. I've only got two bags this month. I usually get four or five, but I've still got some left in the freezer. Got chicken steaks for Ali, ice cream for Ali, some frozen waffles again for Ali. And these pizzas were so cheap, they were like 70 odd p each, so I got quite a few. I got three of the pepperoni ones, and I got a chicken and chorizo one, and a barbecue meat feast. These are for like if Ali's cousins or something come over for dinner. I just like to have something that I can chuck in for them. Okay, for fresh items, we got some of these sweet chilli chicken thighs. I have no idea of the sins for anything at the minute, so I'll look them up and if I can find them on the Slimming World app, I will write them on the screen for anything. So, sweet chilli chicken thighs, some Memphis barbecue pork loin steaks, I got two packets of the 5% lean steak mints, a packet of the quarter pounders, these aren't for me, these are for Ali and his cousins. I got an extra tasty roasting bag chicken. Obviously you take all the skin off this and the chicken's free. I got two rump steaks. These are so cheap. I think they're like 2 99 and they're massive. So I got two of those ones and I got one of the ones with peppercorn butter. That's actually for Mark when he comes over for dinner one night. I got three packets of the smoked back bacon. I'll keep a couple in the freezer and I'll keep one in the fridge. But they'll do the whole month and I'll just cut the fat off and make it sin free for me. I got a three litre jug of semi skimmed milk. This isn't for me, this is for Ali for his cereals and stuff. I've already got enough of the skimmed milk in the fridge. I got a curly leaf parsley. I've got two trays of the 10 Scottish eggs. I've got these four breaded fish fillets. These are actually massive. They're like proper long fish, like the size that you get out of the chip shop. And they were only 2 29 or something like that. Really big and they're obviously not for me. These are for Ali and whoever's over for dinner one night because we always have people over for dinner. A big block of mature coloured cheddar for Ali. Some baby bell lights for me. Some light cheese slices. For me and Ali. I got a packet of the curly kale. I'm sure this was 39p or something. It was so cheap compared to Tesco where it's one pound odd. I got two bags of carrots, two bags of onions, an iceberg lettuce, a packet of mint. I got a punnet of the closed cut mushrooms and a punnet of the button mushrooms. I use loads of mushrooms for omelettes and all oh, mushrooms on toast and everything so They'll not go to waste. Two cucumbers, because we eat loads of this. A packet of the sweet mini peppers, just for nibbling on. Two packets of the baby plum tomatoes. A bunch of spring onions. A bag of the mini bananas. A bag of the little oranges. Some kiwi fruits. A punnet of the mini pears. Two punnets of the wonky strawberries. 
and a punnet of grapes. Okay, for food cupboard items, I got six boxes of cereal, I got a frosted flakes, a honey nut corn flakes, these cinnamon chips, which I think are like the golden grahams or the cinnamon grahams, a packet of choco rice, and two of these crazed pillows. They're Ali's favourite cereals, but he's never tried the Aldi ones, I don't think. Or maybe he did a couple of months ago, but. Um, and he still has some left from last month because I got hundreds last month. These are for Ali's snacks, some cheese curls and some crispy fries. Again, I could probably have these in my sin allowance. I'm not sure about the sin allowance for these, but I'll double check it and I'll write it on the screen. I got him three bottles of the diluting juice. I got summer fruits, peach and that one is apple and pear. Two bottles of the lighter than light mayonnaise. A bottle of ketchup. Again, so much cheaper than Tesco. A jar of pickled onions, a jar of pickled gherkins, I got a sea salt and a black peppercorn grinder, and I got some paprika, four cartons of passata, and two tubes of tomato puree, two of the four packs of baked beans, four cans of chopped tomatoes and I got two of the peeled plum tomatoes because I like these on toast sometimes for my supper or for breakfast. I got 30 cans of the sardines in oil. These are for the dogs. They love sardines. A four pack of sweet corn, two tins of spaghetti, two tins of the baked beans with sausages, two tins of macaroni cheese, two tins of meatballs and tomato sauce and these are all for Ali for like lunches and things a four pack of the tuna chunks and brine this might look excessive but it is to last me the month <laughs> four jars of the the coffee two bags of the easy cook long grain rice a bag of macaroni pasta and i've got a packet of the spaghetti I got these for Ali to try because he likes pot noodles but these were obviously so much cheaper so I got my spicy curry one and a chicken and mushroom one. Again these are for Ali. These were only like 22 pence each. All these instant noodles that he likes for lunches and quick snacks. I got two packets of the beef flavour, two of the chicken, two of the bacon and two of the curry. And I got these for myself to try. They only had two flavours but they're like the mug shot so I like to keep things like this in the cupboard just for emergencies. So I've got two of the spicy sweet and sour noodles and two of the tomato and herb pastas. Again, I'm not sure of the sins, but if they're like the mug shots, they'll only be like one or two sins each. And I'll put it on the screen once I've double checked. Okay, we're on to the last bit from the Lidl shop. So I got a 16 pack of the toilet tissue. That was only £3.30 and I usually get the Tesco stuff, which is about the same price and for nine. So I was super chuffed with that. I got two packets of these all-purpose wipes and a packet of dishcloths because I've none, I've ran out. Packet of the food and freezer bags, again, I've none, I've ran out. Two packets of ibuprofen because I went through quite a lot a few weeks ago when I had the abscess and I need to stock up again. Some treats for the D-O-G-S, I can't say it out loud because they will hear it and they will come and think they're getting some. I got some of these bony bites and these marrows and I actually got eight packets of the dentist sticks. I've got four of the original and four of the minty ones. Packet of cotton buds because I've absolutely none. Again I've run out and these were only 29p or something as opposed to one pound something that I pay at Tesco. And I got two of the Colgate triple action toothpaste. Again they were just super cheap so I got two of them. Okay we're now on to the Tesco items and I didn't get too much for Tesco. Well, I didn't definitely didn't get as much as I got from Aldi and I definitely didn't get as much for my money as I got from Aldi. But these were things that I couldn't find in Aldi or I wanted specific brands or something like that. So, frozen items, I got these bird's eye inspirations, the char grills with tomato and basil sauce. And I think these are half a cent each if I remember right, but I will double check and write it on the screen. I got some boneless chicken thighs. I need these for a recipe that I'm doing, but I can't remember what the recipe is at the minute. It's all upstairs on my notepad. Some chicken dippers for Ali. Yorkshire puddings for Ali. 
For fresh meat, I got 10 of the minted lamb kebabs. These are two cents each. I did double check that before I got these. And they're on offer, three for 10 pounds. So I got meatballs and I got these chicken and chorizo kebabs. These are for Ali because one of his favorite flavors is chicken and chorizo. He's actually having a chicken and chorizo pizza tonight. Um, yeah, so they were three for 10 pounds. So I got all of them. These were two for three pounds. I got some roast beef slices and some wafer thin roast chicken slices and I got corned beef these are one cent a slice so I've got two packets we're going to have corned beef and potatoes one night for dinner because it's actually one of my favorite summertime dinners if you've watched my videos before you've have heard me talking about these I really really like them the corn peppered steaks they actually had none in stock last month when I was trying to get a delivery online so I got them today I've stocked up I got two packets and they were actually on offer three for six pound so I've got a packet of these corn classic burgers. I haven't checked the sins, but I'm assuming that they're sin free. I will double check and write it on the screen though. Tubby patty. I think this is three and a half cents for 25 grams. I will double check. These are a staple item in all my shopping hauls. The laughing cow light with blue cheese. I think you can have five for a healthy extra A choice. And they're one and a half cents each per triangle otherwise. Got these for Ali, just for to have on toast and things. Some light olive spread. Two garlic breads to have with meals and things. Obviously, I won't be having them, but anybody else that's here, I'll have them. I've just this minute realised that I've picked up a regular mozzarella and I meant to pick up a light mozzarella, so I'm going to have to go back to Tesco and get a light one because you get more mozzarella when you get the light ones. I could use this. I would just get a lot less than I would be happy to have. I got some beetroot because I couldn't get any at Aldi's yesterday, they'd sold out. And I couldn't get a single lemon and a single lime yesterday. They'd have them in bags, but I just wanted one of each. So got them at Tesco and I got a garlic. We had none at Aldi, they were sold out. I've got two bags of potatoes. Well, I've got two bags of the regular potatoes. I've also got two bags of the salad potatoes. And I got two packets of the bacon potatoes. These were on offer 39p each, so I just got two of them. And these were on offer £1.25 for four. I only ever get these when they're on offer because they're £2.50 for four is quite a lot. But £1.25 I'm okay with. So I got the lemon ones and uh, the cherry ones. I did actually want to get the blueberry ones, but they had none in stock. They'd sold out, so I had to get the cherry. And I got a big pot of the natural yogurt, the 0% fat, and a big of the fat free from a tree. This is the rest of the Tesco items. I got a massive three kilo bag of pasta, a tin of hot dogs. Ali watches some cooking thing on YouTube and he wants to make something that involves hot dogs and cheese slices and that so that's for him. I got some onion salt, ground all spice and garlic granules. Couldn't get any of them yesterday and all day. And I've got my new fave, which is the lemon and herb Nando's Bag and Bake. These are on offer in Tesco for £1, so I've got two of them. So that means I can have it twice this month. A packet of white pitas and a packet of wholemeal pitas. I think that's because I'm making kebabs at one point this month. Uh, two loaves of wholemeal bread. A packet of white tortilla wraps and a packet of wholemeal tortilla wraps bag of sugar and some decaffeinated tea bags this is what i'm trying to drink at night time now after tea time and that i'm trying to stay off the caffeine easier said than done i got three bottles of the tesco thick bleach which is one pound 20 for three and it's always on that offer but that's my favorite bleach it beats domestos and everything these were an offer so i thought i'd try these i don't think i've tried these before they were two for two pound and I got the lemon one and the ocean one just to try them both out. I, I'm pretty sure I've not tried them before. I got some of the vanilla refills for my plugins. I've got one upstairs, one downstairs. Some of my favourite bubble bath. I got this. It was seven pound. I'm not happy about it, but I really liked the OGX stuff that I got from B&M and when I was in there the other day, no it wasn't B&M, it was Home Bargains and I was in Home Bargains the other day and they didn't have any and I got some 
strawberry laces hand soap and some unicorn magic hand soap they were on offer in tesco for 90p and i got those ones because i'm really a 12 year old girl inside excuse the bleeping that is ali's pizza telling me it's ready okay we're now on to the asda stuff and as you can see there really really isn't a lot and i went to asda specifically because they had the fairy on offer which is my favorite washing powder they had that on offer for six pounds and it does 40 washes yeah 40 washes and i also got this comfort pure which is my favorite fabric softener and that was on offer too i got some tin foil Again, I went to Asda because these were on offer. The stock pots, the eight packs are two pounds. So I got a chicken one and I got a vegetable one. And this is the real reason that I went to Asda because I have been looking for this for ages and I think they've just started to restock it in the one local to me. So I'm very, very happy. It was 2 49 which is expensive, but I really love it. And I don't use it a lot. It will be used to make maybe little garlic breads or garlic toast if I have an Italian meal, you know, spaghetti bolognese or something like that. I'm just so happy to have found it. And these were on offer. These were £1.50 each, so I've got two of them. They're just the regular sunflower oil fry light. Again, these were on offer. These were 50p each, and I can't remember the sins. Again, I'll pop it on the screen. I tried this a few months ago, or maybe even just last month or something like that. I can't remember, but I really liked it. And I am a pesto fan and it gave me my pesto fix. So I do recommend them if you like it. I mean, it's not overpowering the pesto flavour, but it's nice. It's nice and I think they're quite low sins, three or four sins or something, but I will double check. I have a recipe that I want to try this month. I can't remember the name of it, but it does involve orzo pasta. And I couldn't get this in Tesco, which is another reason I went to Asda. These were cheaper in Asda than they were in Tesco, so I got two of them. I picked this up because it was 70p and I thought Ali can have that and toast in that for his supper and then I totally forgot that I'd already got the cheese triangles for him, but it's not going to go to waste. I mean, it doesn't go out of date until October. It doesn't go out of date until October. This was 2 49 for 500 grams, which I thought was quite good. I think I usually pay £3 for 500 grams at Tesco, so I got some of the 50% reduced fat mature cheddar. These were on offer for a pound and I thought they might be nice for toast or something one night so I picked up them. Just the light Philadelphia minis. I'm not sure what the sins are but I will again double check. I was watching Ryan and Eden's YouTube channel and one of them are doing Slimming World and they'd made a pie and the crust of the pie was made out of peas pudding so I want to try that one night. Make some sort of pie. I don't know what I'm going to put in it yet but definitely going to try and make a peas pudding crust pie. So I couldn't get these in Tesco's either, at my local Tesco's anyway, so I had to go up to Asda and got them. So I got four just in case I might want to try it again. So that was everything. I know it probably seemed a little bit excessive. I mean, it probably definitely was a little bit excessive. But I do feel that I got so much more from my money doing it the way that I've done it this month. I'm not sure I would do it every month because it's quite a lot going to three different shops within a couple of days of each other. But... I do feel like I've got a lot more from money, like I just said. And I also feel that I'm going to have a better variety of meals this month. Because like I said at the start of the video, I've just felt so inspired in the past month or so. Because it's always the same things that I get from Tesco over and over again. So I wasn't feeling very inspired to cook new meals. But now that I've went to three different shops and got all the things that I wanted to make, for the month ahead, I do feel that you might even see a bit of a variety in my meals this coming month in the Meals of the Weeks video, which is uploaded on a Wednesday morning at 8am. Anyway, thank you so much for watching, guys. Please don't forget to like this video if you enjoyed it. Subscribe if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram at the Mad Scots, and I will see you next time.